very worrisome. EU foreign policy chief Joseph Borrell was somber as he spoke to journalists on Monday morning. We are facing some events, some facts that certainly worries me as a former president of the European Parliament also. There is a police and judiciary actions. We have to follow these actions. Worries which are shared by other officials in Brussels. Well, it is damaging, um, and, uh, and we need to get to the bottom of it. Uh, and uh, we, we need to have, obviously, a full and transparent investigation so that we can have an explanation for what's happened. Uh, the European Parliament is a very important institution, uh, and this is a scandal that we need to expose the truth around uh, so that we can ensure it doesn't happen again. MEP Eva Cayley, who is also one of the Parliament's vice presidents, was taken into custody and charged with corruption over the weekend. She was reportedly found with bags of cash, thought to have been gifted from Qatar. The MEP visited Doha just ahead of the World Cup and has been vocal in defense of the Gulf state. Today, the World Cup in Qatar is a proof, actually, of how sports diplomacy can achieve a historical transformation of a country. I alone said that Qatar is a front runner in labor rights, abolishing kafala and reducing minimum wage, despite the challenges that even European companies are denying to enforce these laws. On Monday morning, Athens announced it was freezing all her assets. Several other people have been charged, and prosecutors in Brussels have seized 600,000 euros as part of the ongoing probe.